Okay, we're here in my backyard here in Orlando, Florida, and we are going to attempt to grow a vegetable garden using cocoa pipa as our growing medium. We're going to be using cocoa pipa in grow bags. And the first step is get your cocoa pipa. Get it at your local hydroponic store. You go out, you buy a wash tub. Cheap little wash tub from a discount store. You drill holes in the bottom of the wash tub because your cocoa core comes in a compressed block, or the kind I get does anyway. It's cheaper that way. You put the block in the tub. You fill it with water. The block absorbs and breaks up in the water. Absorbs the water, breaks up, and then you're going to let that drain down. You're going to fill it up with water once again. Let it drain down. This has been sitting here since yesterday. It's wonderful stuff, cocoa core. It's really nice, airy, light, fluffy, doesn't harden like peat moss does. Um, it's reusable. It's great, great stuff. Anyway, and what's really cool about it is it looks nice and dry, but yet when you squeeze it, water comes out of it. Neat stuff. So we're going to be taking this cocoa core, we're going to be putting it in these three gallon grow bags. You pick those up at your local hydroponic store. They're about a quarter a piece. And we're going to be taking our seedlings that we started again in the cocoa core. Fill your tray up with cocoa core. Again, get this at any gardening center or hydroponic store. Fill that with the cocoa core. Put your little, you can get a little pencil or your finger and just poke a little hole, put your seeds in. Cover with a little more cocoa core, a little bit of pearl or vermiculite, and then they should all start. Mine did. Okay, so we're going to be taking those seedlings again. We're going to be putting them in these grow bags, and then we're going to be taking those grow bags and putting them under these trellises that I have scattered around the yard.